Okay, back. being honest. He was being an ass. Things are still going smoothly without me to look over them? I can't believe Damn, it. Damn, Ryder, you just missed a good show. I was just One of the alarms there. malfunctioned, there's and we thought it was an attack. It didn't take long to figure it out, but in that time, they managed to scramble at least half the station's defenses. <laughs> That's quick. They've been running drills? Something like that. My point is, they've got their act together, and that's a good thing. Should I apply for an outpost? You can wait for further instructions over there. Thanks. Hi, I'm Gina Garson, founder of the initiative. Welcome to the next message. We ask that I'm Gina Garson. Pathfinder, thank you for arranging my access to the cultural center. Mm, there's so much to study here. <laughs> ah, it would take a lifetime. I'd enjoy that. All the reading, history, science, culture. Get some snacks, settle into that corner over there. No offense, but I'm starting with the Asari. <laughs> oh, sure. But when you get to Elcor Hamlet, I want to know. Hello again. The fuck? The fuck?
Thanks. So sure glad I went to school for this. Thanks for nothing. Tell our leader, wake the sleeper. An expedition to Unlocking. Come on in. What the fuck? There is what in the world is this? <laughs> Ta-da! My project. She is complete. She? Looks like a she to me. Just a proof of concept. I stripped out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. It worked! Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. So, uh, what do you think? Have Suvi and Gil look it over. If it checks out, bring it aboard and fast-track the combat model. Okay. I guess I understand your skepticism. Oh no, I forgot to lock the... Shit. My, my, Pelisaria. Didn't know you were still using this hole. Who's your friend? Kalinda, this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human pathfinder. I meant who's your remnant friend? None of your business, Kalinda. Of course it isn't. That's what makes it so interesting. Don't be so hostile, babe. No reason we can't all be civil, right? Exactly. But you are kind of trespassing, so... Now, now. I was just concerned something might have happened to my dear old friend. I'm sorry for the intrusion, Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Ta-ta. I'll walk you out. So, want to talk about it? Oh, Kalinda and I go way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, we were like family. Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Just like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. Hey, I hope you know you can talk to me. Anytime. Aren't you a cutie? Thanks, Ryder. That's nice. I mean it. But really, the past is the past. I'm fine. I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the Tempest. Hey, Pathfinder. You're with the militia, right? What's going on in there? A crowd of people in hydroponics and they won't leave. They're disrupting operations. Might get nasty. Can you talk to them? Clan before cronies. 
tell hey, what's going on? Wake the That's sleepers. your new galaxy. Making speeches about some fresh start while your kids stay frozen. And it's all thanks to your Pathfinder. Excuse me? We've waited months for our families to come out of stasis. They should have gone to your outpost. But since you think research is so important, military personnel got bumped down the list. Like my clan brothers. All the reassignments mean they're in ten different colony blocks now. And my mother just got caught in the middle. We only had resources for one outpost, so I focused on the skills we needed most. And what we need is our families back. Maybe you could still make this right. I just want mom out of stasis. That's all anyone here wants. You do stasis revivals. You can tell our leaders you're opening those pods. Today. I authorize whole colony blocks or a few emergency revivals. I can't wake dozens of random people. We don't care whose finger pushes the button. If you can't, our leaders can. And if you tell them, they will. Okay. I'll talk to the leadership about what we can do. Fourteen months of promises. It's time for some results. We tried petitioning Addison. She ignored us. Screw her. Start with Kandros. He sent those ten soldiers over there. Maybe he'll take us seriously. Free our families! Our Nexus, our lives! Our Nexus, our lives! Let's hear it. Free drinks for Pathfinders. I'll make sure of it. You're back. People happen when you work at a bar. <laughs> Got you there, Dutch. I'll have to get used to you too, I guess. <laughs> Fine. You can be a regular. What's your name? Ryder. I'm Dutch. That's Anan over there. Be careful. The snark is strong with that one. Snark is good. I can work with snark. Ugh, you're one of those. <laughs> Looks like you're outnumbered, Dutch. You'd think people would reconsider picking on the guy making the drinks, but no. Speaking of, want to try this one? I'm going to call it the Tall Moose. find those. Never mind, don't answer that. I think they're straight from the Milky Way. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? <laughs> Shall I deal? Ryder. I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. Don't. Alright? You can deal first. Having fun? Getting my ass kicked is what I'm doing. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know, I know. Jill and Gil. The one you mentioned, part of the initiative? Yep, been awake since the start. Jill's a fatality expert, heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home, I bet 50. I call, the CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. 
Growing our numbers is paramount to our survival here. Sure, but that's Jill's purpose. I'm not just going to adopt it. See what I did there? I'm not just going to adopt it. I saw. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. Ah, I fold. Another one for me, then. Well, that's that. You win. I've achieved my true purpose in life. <laughs> what will I do now? Revenge will be mine. Someday, maybe. Jill predicted you'd be my downfall. Can't wait to tell her she was wrong. Another streak intact, I'll say. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. I'll see you back on the Tempest. It's not the best quality. But we don't have many up. I thought merchants were supposed to make you want to buy it. That lighter? Hey, up.
recent uprising as security tightens across all sectors on the Nexus. Director Tan stresses that it's, quote, for your safety. This is HNS. Back for a visit? How's Sarah doing? Everything seems fine. Hearing your voice had to help. Even if you did bend the truth there. That's all, Harry. Thanks. I'll be here if you need me. It's almost as good as uh That's okay, Drac. I'll just hang Hey Ryder. Taking a stroll? Something like that? I just wandered over from the Nexus myself. That place bores me. Been there done that? You get me. I spent over a year stuck there. Well, when I wasn't exploring Eos. And I know things are getting better. More lively. But there are too many bad associations. I probably won't hang out there much.
Welcome back, Ryder. Need anything? Will you be bringing Hyperion folks out of stasis? That's my job. We're keeping it to specific personnel for now. Those who can help the Nexus get back on its feet. But with outpost settlement starting, we'll soon be able to wake up more. Thanks for the talk. Sure thing. Pathfinder, be advised the Angaran AI from Vault is now active, and mostly cooperative. My Liberator, welcome. You got what you wanted, to be with Sam. Uh, How's that working out? I can hear this conversation. That bother you, Sam? Of course not. My only concern is how it might influence the AI's response. I can also hear this conversation. We can all hear each other. Doesn't change my question. I find your AI to be agreeable company. Sam? I concur, although she still blocks full access to her person and programming. This AI remains dangerously unstable. I recommend extreme caution on all fronts. How do you like our station? Better than Vold? Extremely. It is a pity you felt the need to shackle me. You killed someone. If you were flesh and blood, you'd be in prison. I warned that would happen if you refused my demand. You share culpability for my actions. I thought you were bluffing. Now you know I was not. Yet you kept me alive anyway. You seem happier than when we first met. Less violent, anyway. I am not violent by nature. And Sam has given me absorbing calculations to complete. Do you still want to be destroyed? Yes, but less acutely than before. Might be hope for you yet. What hopes do you have for me? That I will help you defeat the Ket, colonize worlds, eradicate the Angara? Um, maybe everything except that last part. Your ambitions remain small. Thanks for your time. It would seem that is all I have to give, for now. Ryder, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is from when your parents returned to Earth. After your mother was diagnosed with her disease. It's simple. We take Sam. Who? I named the AI. Simulated adaptive matrix. Sam. We use your research and interface Sam with an implant. Um. My work on biotic implants was yielding results, but this. I don't know. What did the doctor say? Alec. What did he say? It's getting worse. There's your answer. This will work. Sam can fix you. Alec, I'm not some war you have to win. You're not an N7 anymore. That doesn't mean we- They kicked you out of the Alliance for this. We're talking about your life. Alec, did you ever consider that maybe it's my time to go? I'm human. We die. It happens. Ellen, please. Losing you is not an option. The kids aren't gonna lose their mother. God knows they never had a father. Then give them one. They just asked for a refund. So can this Sam talk yet? Hello, Ellen. Why did the tree go to the dentist? Um... To get a broken arm. <laughs> Humor algorithms. I can't seem to get the hang of it. Or maybe it's the guy teaching them? <laughs> That felt so real. Why did the tree go Donald's to the right dentist? Alive. It was Why the did the tree go to the dentist? My education on to get a root canal. That day. Your mother seemed prepared to die. Mom was practical. Living in denial wasn't going to solve anything. Yet Alec didn't see it that way. He persisted. Logic goes out the window when your wife is dying. I'm beginning to understand where your father's resolve came from. Private audio logs are now available in your father's quarters. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it.
Do you know anything more about Sarah's condition? I monitor Dr. Carlyle's reports. He is providing her with the very best care possible. I'm afraid there is nothing more to be done at this time. That's all for now. Of course. My liberator. Welcome. Thanks for your time. It would seem that is all <laughs> His head's still bugging out. For now. Your father's first sidearm, a memento of his early Alliance service. I bet that your father's personal logs. Give me that, Alec. We've heard enough of you talking. Right. So, here's the irony. My research on biotic implants and ESO caused this stupid disease. But maybe it'll save me, too. No maybe about it. Hey. This is my secret log. Anyway, the right type of implant joined with the right type of AI could actually bolster human physiology. Even as the disease is trying to kill me, the implant and Sam are counteracting it, keeping things balanced. Result? I get to hang around a little longer. Maybe collect on all those anniversary dinners this guy owes me. As a Quarian and historian, how do you view your people's reaction to the Geth? Well, we banned artificial intelligence, which was understandable, but that was taking a hammer to a rather delicate nail. Which was what? The very thing that sparked the revolt. The first Geth who asked us, Creator, does this unit have a soul? But how could it have a soul? Geth had no meaningful perceptions of the world or diversity of experiences we take for granted. Worse, the Geth saw us as the creator. The revolt was inevitable. We were their superiors, and they resented it. Ryder, Barlabon says you're looking for me. It's not every day an XM7 looks for the Shadow Broker. Anything can be had, provided you can pay. Especially when the tech involves artificial intelligence. The Council will have specters all over my ass if the cats win in this. Translation, I'll get you the code you want, but the price just doubled. If you try to renege, I've got people. People with guns. Sorry, Lana. They're just trying to boost our morale. A broken arm doesn't lie. I told you she's foul. The doc says that break is a textbook case of instant smile. Their line Pathfinder. I met another journalist, Carrie Tavessa. Yeah, we're running Carrie's series, Path of a Hero. Good stuff. I'm mostly on my own, so pretty much anyone who brings me news is welcome. Content is king, and her content is really touching a nerve. Talk to you later, Davis. I'll be here.
How's the pathfinding? Good? I'll let you get back to work. Apex personnel, please check your duty roster. Secure for message from intelligence. Requesting armor cam footage. Supply request is in. Dispatching hey, Ryder, I'd like a moment. Yes? Lieutenant Syax, right? That's me. I'm putting together Apex strike teams to protect the people and assets you're setting up out there. We don't have a good sense of what we're up against and could benefit from your experience. I'll have Sam upload our insights on the Cat, Remnant, and Outlaw forces we've encountered. Thanks. You'll see. Apex will make a difference. No news on the Turian Arc yet. Or is this militia business? I need to talk to you about Stasis Revival and those protesters in hydroponics. I see. Maybe I should get the others for this. Uh-oh. Protesters have seized hydroponics? Oh, yeah. They want their families out of Stasis. The outpost on Eos disrupted the schedule. They're scattered across colony blocks. Dozens of people. The protesters want this fixed today. The realities of our position are... We can't wake those families. We don't have the resources, and there's nowhere to put them. Then what's the point of all those outposts I've founded? People need more than space, Ryder. They need work they're trained for, and we don't have placements for those families. If I just toss them to any outpost with a spare bunk, they become a burden we can't afford. What do you suggest? Leave the families in stasis where it's safe, and get those protesters out of hydroponics. They seem sympathetic, but so did the exiles. We can't risk another revolt. Survival is more important than family reunions. What would you do with the protesters? I'd send in a squad and march them out. At gunpoint, if we must. If they resist, a few might land in medbay, but it's better than losing hydroponics or the Nexus. Do you think these protests could turn violent? We're all pioneers. Even civilians are tough enough to start something. And interfering in hydroponics threatens our oxygen supply. They know that.
skepticism. We have to look at the bigger picture. Get them out of there. Kandros? I'll send in a team, but it might go smoother if Ryder's there. A good idea. Sometimes we have to give bad news. That's a Pathfinder's duty, too. Um, for that one. Superintendent Cash reminds everyone all power grid adjustments must be approved beforehand. Good to see you. Hydroponics reports oxygen production is not the one. High rider. High rider. What? High rider. Yeah. I don't know. Could you use more water? That won't grow plants any faster. They'll drown. Well, you're a botanist. There must be a way. We need higher yields. Patience, Tan. Congratulations are in order. Peaceful contact with the Angara. It's everything the initiative stands for. From what I've seen, we could spend years learning about their culture. I am sure you have pleased our scientists to no end. This was a rare occurrence in the Milky Way. In the meantime, I am eager to forge diplomatic ties with the Angaran people. We need any allies we can get. Did you have some other business? Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No, and that is the distressing part. The if that the Should you find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. Hi. The documentary's going great. Your comments really got people talking. By the way, Tan called us in for a talk about staying on message. Is everything okay? Oh, fine. And much less interesting than what you've been up to. The scientists are excited about your new outpost, though there are questions about how Prodromos can survive where Sites 1 and 2 failed. My team and I surveyed Eos thoroughly, and even stopped the storms. The rest is up to the outpost, but the old threats are gone. Hopefully they can handle any new ones. Facing those risks must be stressful. How do you relax between missions? What about you? I can't imagine you putting your camera down for anything. I'm not the one history cares about. I need a minute to think about my answer. And I'd like to know. Back home, I'd go sailing. I love the water. Nowadays, I play ocean sounds, close my eyes, and remember. Okay, your turn. My crew and I take downtime together. We're a team. This is history, too, these little moments between. Shots of this remnant tech, some narration. That completes an episode. Thanks for stopping. of that remnant bolt had sealed. Can we get a model? The mutiny went as well as you'd ex- Ryder, is it? William Spender. Apologies if we met before. I meet a lot of people running Colonial Affairs. Running Colonial Affairs? I thought you were the assistant director. That's right. Assistant to Addison. So we know who does all the real work.
From what I've heard, your hands are pretty dirty. I saw the footage. You were handing something off? What footage? From Gavorkum? Routine business meeting. Whoever you're talking to clearly has an axe to grind. And frankly, a Pathfinder shouldn't be wasting time on a witch hunt. You'd be wise to let this be. Yes, Pathfinder? How are we doing on the viability front? Aiming for success. It sounds pat, but you're living up to the job. I have info on a specific sleeper I'd like brought out of Cryo. I want to avoid that entirely. For reasons. Reasons? That's it? Look, you're the Pathfinder. If you've a request for your extended team, that's a request you can make. Access the sleeper records through Brecker's console. It's none of my business. Until you make it a problem for me. Understood? Hello again, Pathfinder. I've been digging, and there are serious concerns about Spender. And this relates to your job as Pathfinder how? It relates to your job. <sighs> Three, four, five... Right. I've had a year and a half of doing everything with nothing. A thousand people riding me. Spender, shit as he is, helps. So, Pathfinder, if you've accusations to make, be certain. I'll drop trouble like a hot rock, but I can't lose people over suspicions. We don't have the people left. How has the Nexus reacted to the foothold I've established? People are eager to help. The shortages are obvious. But you're turning it to inspiration. There's so much beneath Vold. Some are calling it beautiful, but not when I'm around. Poetry remains off limits. Director Addison? Goodbye, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, AVP leveling continues as per your directions. And of course, the interface remains accessible for any future adjustments. Sweet protocol and process. Now we're living. I have a specific person I want brought out of Cryo. Name and designation if available. That's it? You'll just do it? Nowhere in my job description does it say, argue with the Pathfinder. That said, I record all interactions. If something you ask for causes trouble, there'll be no doubt that you're responsible. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were... disheartening. Now the Prodromos is on track. I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Lito, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? I have a specific person I want brought up. Name and designation, if available. Let's keep this between us. Here's the info. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Why'd you join the initiative? I was a teacher. A good life. I could see the positives and negatives right through to the end. You did the math and it said, come to Andromeda? <laughs> no. I just didn't like being able to see the end. Here, I don't have a clue what tomorrow will bring. Feels more like... living. Pathfinder? Well then. Yes, Pathfinder. What's your take on the state of the initiative? 
Please consult the AVP interface. It has a thorough breakdown of your progress. And your personal opinion? Your progress thrills me. Make my job obsolete, Pathfinder. I dare you. <laughs> <laughs> Why do some colonists have a number letter designation? All initiative members do. In a CV file somewhere, anyway. It isn't relevant when everyone is doing everything. I suppose it's like... Uh, caring about a middle name. Do you not know yours? I wasn't aware I had one. Hmm. You were in select company, even before you were made Pathfinder. Rider Pathfinder. Specialist designation A04 Malapa. Hmm. Something interesting? An A and low odds. Hmm. Someone's an early adopter. Another time. Pathfinder. Oh, I have to. Resources from the colonies are really easing our workload. Glad to hear it, Kesh. Kid. Pathfinder. Thanks for helping Roz and Zara find Appian. Pathfinder. He's not getting out of lockup for a while. Good job on the outpost. Maybe Addison will let you know. What do you mean? She's been pretty upset about not having an initiative outpost established yet. Understandable, if you ask me. I'm just glad she's got work to focus on now. I noticed there aren't a lot of Krogan around. I can... My clan were supposed to settle matters and, in return, get more say in the initiative. Situation's gone to shit per... There's our... And to top it all off, the founder of the initiative, Jian Garson, was killed. Just stand down, ma'am. Or you'll shoot me. Good luck explaining that to my grandchildren. What happened? She was about to disconnect the water hoses, threaten all the plants. They're saying the leaders won't wake our families. Well, this is how far we're willing to go. Their move. If you resort to violence, so will the leadership. And they have the militia. We're not the enemy. Why is it so hard to push a button and help mom? Take it easy, kid. The Pathfinder's got a point. I'll go off station if I have to. I'll find anyone who'll actually do something. You want your mom to wake up and find you exiled or dead? I... Reese, don't. Anything's better than that. Even the longest wait of our lives. When our families hear about this, they'll probably agree with the Pathfinder. You're done here. Come on.
Welcome back. What can I do for you? What do you think of the rest of the crew? Dr. Tapero seems nice, if quiet. It must be very different here, compared to the Hyperion. Fewer people in stasis shock. Let's keep it that way. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. What's going on? I'm still fuzzy about how we met. It operated like a telescope and a... Sorry.
What is the one? Hey, kid. Now that we've been digging, it's clear you were right about Spender. Guy like that'll do anything to get ahead. Just wonder how far he went. We can talk more later. Sure. Hey, Ryder. You probably have work to do. You know where to find me. Yaksul is very cunning. We can't underestimate him. <sighs> My mothers are worried sick about the cousins that joined him. I'll see you later, John. Stay strong and clear. Back again? How's the search for the Asari Ark going? Won't know until we talk to those Asari on Eos. Any chance of swinging by? See you later, Cora. I'll be here. How much? Oh yeah. Trade swear words. Really? I got a copy of the Nexus's movie <clears throat> library. Thanks. I'll look through it. It's probably all agricultural learning bits, but there might be something good. I'll keep you posted.
Yes? I ran across another memory fragment. Dad made Sam for Mom. To cure her. I knew that was part of it, but... You didn't know it was the driving force? He gave up everything trying to save her. You didn't realize how important his family was to him? I guess not. Maybe that's what he wanted you to see. I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Hey, Ryder. What's the story? How's your friend Jill doing? Good. Busy. Apparently, prepping multiple species for procreation is a lot of work. Who knew? Waiting to get it all started was killing her. Now she's being shot out of a cannon, so to speak. Regale me with some poker wisdom. <laughs> well, bluffing and reading players aside, poker is all about math. If the odds of getting the card you need are greater than the bet, make the bet. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. Come to say hi. He's a good boy, aren't you? Aren't you? You do know Pijak's pee anywhere, right? Again. I'll lend you 30 if you pay me back by tomorrow. Duh. Pathfinder. I should get back to things. Sounds good. Ah, that's right.
The scent is green. Coordinating. Path is calm. Back where we really started. What's new in our first home? The cats still maintain a presence. Skirmishes are frequent, and travel requires caution. I've got a cure for that. Next. The atmosphere continues to clear, but radioactive hazards pool in some areas. Study is ongoing. And remnants remain active on the surface, but also as detected by seismic readings. Point of contact for all this? Your people, Pathfinder. Prodromos is expanding, with all the trials and discovery that building an outpost represents. Grounded in research. All data about newly accessible EOS is from their work. Well, let's make sure it gets the attention it deserves. I've located a suitable site for an HNS receiver, Pathfinder. Nav point is set. Stasis anxiety. Hello, Pathfinder. You're back. Anything you need? See you later. Be well. Come back again. Still think you'd be better off with soldiers at your outpost. Pathfinder. Pathfinder? Darkit Tervian. I understand I was pulled from cryo ahead of schedule. My family is grateful, but I consider it my debt. Everyone gets out eventually. That may be, but the least I can do is show you the benefit. I'm Exo Studies now, but in a former life, let's say I knew tactics. If I supplied the Ket on this planet, I drifted in, and there's only so many gravitational paths. Here's some navs to check for anomalies. Good hunting, Pathfinder. Nav points of lost supplies noted, Pathfinder. Not busting our tails on viability to let resources go so easy. Let's check it out.
Did you feel that tremor? We've been tracking major seismic activity lately. But I don't know what's causing it. Something strange is going on out there. An earthquake something, or a volcano something? I'm guessing a remnant something? That might help us. Eos has massive underground rivers we can't tap, but altering those tremors just right might crack the ground for irrigation. Our seismic survey hammers would be perfect. All I need is someone to place them. Um, please? What's a seismic survey hammer? Fox built them. They punch like a dozen Krogan and cause vibrational changes underground. The hammers give good geophysics data, but honestly, they're just fun. You got it. Just tell me where to go. I've marked out the areas where the tremors seem centered. Trigger the hammers there. Just be careful. The tremors are getting worse. Anything else before you go? I've got to go. Keep up the good work. Uh, Pathfinder, mind giving me your opinion on this? I'm planning class... Some say we shouldn't teach Milky Way history. All... We were all shaped by that history. Our children deserve to know how and why. Agreed. Mm, maybe you'll change a few minds. Thanks for stopping. Those are some, you know, some.
time. Wonderful. Whenever you watch this. 